Jen, you wanna you wanna be in the you wanna be in the video? You wanna share you have anything to share? Money wise? <laughs> I like your comment about don't get a girl for it. <laughs> All right, guys. Hello. Welcome. Hello, episode 14. YouTube land. We're on episode 14. Episode 14. Like Attack of the clothes. Military life. No, wait. Is it 14 or 13? It's 13 or 14. We're going to talk about today how to not spend all your money in the na military, navy, any branch. I guess it'll apply to anything. Well, if you're getting, if you're planning to get out of the military, make sure you save up a lot of money because you want to have a yeah. mission. Just in case. Yeah, a nice little nest egg. Yes. And if you're on deployment, it's super easy. At least a couple thousand. Yes. At least, minimum. At least. At least. So first, when you're starting off in the Navy or military as an E1, E2, or E3, you're not going to be getting that much of a paycheck. Um, so the most important thing is you don't want more than 30% of your money going towards a vehicle. I say even 20%. You know, yeah, I don't buy, you don't, you don't, don't wanna, get a brand new with car. A fi you don't want a $500 car payment. And a car payment, yeah. With like four or five. That's like the dumbest, and that's like what every person in the military does. That's what does. they all do. It's retarded. So just don't do it. And then that's when you're like, why am I saving any money? Where's all my money going? Well, it's going to car insurance and your <laughs> car payment. <laughs> and a thing that I did that I, you shouldn't do when you're first starting off, don't go eat off base all the time and buy food. Yeah. Eat on base. Use that BAS, you know, don't waste all your money going to Subway or going to the next on base and just buying junk. Yeah, alcohol. That's <laughs> alcohol I just see a lot too. Because I was trying to think like, as a, when I was an E1, E2, E3, where was all my money going? It wasn't, yeah, I, I don't know where. Mine went to a car payment. Car payment? Yeah. You can save a lot of money, you know, you should, you're, you should set up your TSP, your thrift savings mm -hmm. plan. Set that sh set that up. Have at least at least ten percent of your monthly income going towards your TSP. That's that's on the low side. Uh, you know, you should at least maybe twenty percent if you can swing it. Just do it, and you won't miss set it. Set it and forget it. Yeah, you won't miss it. But um, you can be you can save a lot of money. You can be pretty if you're frugal in the military. You know, if you don't if you live a frugal lifestyle, you can save a lot and set yourself up pretty good. Looking at also this. pro tip here. If you're with Navy Federal, you get paid a day before everybody else. So normally USA. you get paid on the what? USA. USAA USA. also. Normally you get paid on the first and fifteenth. If you have those one of those two banks, you'll get paid a day before. So the thirty-first and like the thirteenth or fourteenth. So yeah, okay. that's good. I want to say look out for predator loan sharks. All predatory that lenders. They'll charge you. I am not kidding you. Like seventy-five percent interest. If you don't read your contract carefully, oh so yeah, be very careful. Yeah, don't do any predatory loans, um, like the need cash now, those yes, kind of things. Those are the worst. One eight hundred need cash now. You don't or need whatever. cash. Go sit on the ship and wait it out. Yeah, if you're in that situation, then you're messing up with something. You're doing something wrong with your money. But like, like I said, if you if you can still live a good lifestyle and buy new things and have fun, you just. Um, budget and know where all your money's going like you know like I was saying another thing is once you start making a lot of money or getting advanced and stuff don't watch out for like lifestyle inflation um, you don't want to start spending all that extra money you're getting now just start keep your same lifestyle start and just save all that extra income that you get you know you don't need to lifestyle inflation is a thing you want to watch out for girlfriends are very expensive um, in the military they want those. They want those bennies. <laughs> they want the benefits. They want your benefits. They're like Tricare. Yes, I love you, but I love Tricare more. Oh, you know. And then they're gonna. And then they're gonna. You know, you're just gonna get pregnant, and then boom, then you're really locked in. Yeah. So there's girls out there that go after yeah. guys in the military mm -hmm. um, for to for stuff like I was just saying. And they actually, they do research on like what they can get if they marry a guy and yes. divorce yep. like Contract yes. marriages. It's pretty bad. Yes. Yeah. And yeah, if you do you know date, saying? take a girl on a hike, it's free, you know? Go hiking. Free stuff. <laughs> go, you know, yeah. go to the park. Invite her for coffee, it's like two bucks. Get like a coloring book or yeah. something? Yeah. Something cheap. <laughs> coloring book. Uh, guys, that's going to wrap it up for today's episode. Um, just a little laid back kind of thing we're doing today. 
Uh, next week, though, episodes every week, mostly around Tuesday or Wednesday, we come out with these. We are getting a Marine soon to add to the squad. So we're going to have we different... Some, we're going we're gonna to have some crazy perspective getting some <laughs> Marines in here. And yeah, sticker fire, some stickers coming out, social media and stuff below as always. And hope you guys have a good day. Clippers! I live in LA, so I'm not bandwagoning, right? Yeah. <laughs> I live literally in LA, so I can support the Clippers. Alright, goodbye!